This was Jasper after his injury in 2008. He couldn't move his hind legs, but thanks to a pioneering treatment, Jasper went from being paralyzed to walking with the aid of a harness, and then finally running by himself. Scientists at the University of Cambridge took the cells from Jasper's nose and injected them into his damaged spinal cord. Professor Nicholas Jeffrey designed the study. The cells that we used, when they're in the nose, they usually help nerve fibres to grow from the nose into the brain. That's their normal function in the nose. And so the idea is that when you transplant them into the spinal cord or anywhere else in the nerve system, then they might also help new nerve fibres to grow from one place to another. And it's not just Jasper who's whizzing around the house again. The scientists say some of the other dogs in the study regained limited use of their hind legs. But the researchers acknowledge that this procedure alone would not likely have any useful benefit for human spinal cord injury patients. I don't think there's ever going to be a, a quick fix for spinal cord injury. But Jeffrey says he believes it's a small step in the right direction. Max Foster, CNN London.